Coming to you live from the Westgate Cocoa Beach Pier where it has started to rain. The good thing is four hours early. We have team coverage coming to you this noon of today's big launch. Why don't we start with New Six's James Sparvero live at the Kennedy Space Center. And James, those astronauts could start walking out to their cars any minute. Well, we got an update on that, Justin. It's going to be 1.13, so a little over an hour here at the Armstrong Operation and Checkout Building. Let's show you the video we recorded at 9.30 this morning. We believe this to be the first video of the astronauts today, and it's the only video we know of since. Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley walking out the door. You see Bankin with coffee or tea in his hand. Hurley, he later tweeted that he had steak and eggs for breakfast. They're in casual clothes. And what they're doing right here is they're taking two mission stickers for today's mission, SpaceX Demo 2, and they're put, placing them on the windshields of each of the Tesla Model Xs that will ride them out to launch pad 39A. So that was our indication that Bob and Doug were up for the day. We knew they'd be up somewhere between six or seven hours before liftoff casual clothes. The next time we see them at 1.13 this afternoon, we expect them to be in their SpaceX spacesuits. You probably remember them because they just put them on Saturday during the dress rehearsal, and this is the same location for the run-through, the dry dress where they came out, they posed for NASA cameras, they turned the corner right here, they got into the Tesla Model Xs, they had a big escort. There's about a half dozen Kennedy Space Center police vehicles here right now. There's helicopters in the air, and then they're headed out to the launch pad ahead of the liftoff, which we are still targeting for 4.33 this afternoon. We'll show you the astronauts when we see them, and we will also show you Vice President Mike Pence expected to be right here as well. Live at NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, getting results, News 6.